fanning the globe to bring you the constant variety of sport. The thrill of victory. And the agony of defeat. The human drama of athletic competition. This is ABC's Wide World of Sports. I'm Howard Dixell, along with Jack Webb, Boomer Drake, and Daisy McQuacken. And we're here this evening to bring you the finals of the Pro and Amateur Sled Duck Championships. But first, I would like to bring to your attention and thank all of you for all your kind words and letters sent to Farmer Drake for his horrific accident. We have new footage from our outdoor cameras that showed exactly what happened. A viewer warning, this is disturbing. This is Seabiscuit. He found Farmer Drake and he's flipping him all over the place. Well, we can't get him out of his mouth. Then we found the most horrific other things. Jack, go ahead and take that over. Yeah, Howard, it was insane. There were dead ducks everywhere. Just this is just a sleigh yard, but it was like a massacre of ducks. I'm gonna. I think Howard, he's lucky to be alive. Let's hear from him. Uh, let's hear from him now. Thank you, Jack and Daisy and Howard and Boomer. Um, I'm doing okay, and I would like to take this opportunity to thank all my fans. I've um, just had some just lovely, lovely letters, and people are very concerned about me. And um, I had Dr. Um, Duxie, um well, a lot of doctors helped me, actually. And Fauci, he was the best. He repaired my beak, and uh, I can't I take a bandage off for a while, but I think I'm doing okay. I just wanted everybody to know, from the bottom of my duck heart, I'm just very grateful for each and every one of you. I'm sorry, I'm just a little choke up right now. Um, thank you, and that's all I had to say. Thank you, Howard. We're just really, really glad that you're okay. And now let's take it down to the field with Boomer Drake. Well, thanks, Jack. Um, I'm getting ready for the finals right now. We have a huge lineup, and uh, Daisy McQuacken is down getting their hovercraft warmed up. Oh, 
Daisy, Daisy, this is Boomer. Can you hear me, Daisy? Daisy, can you hear me? Oh, well, I think they took Daisy's hovercraft right out. I think she hovered on it. She hovered in. We're going to have to send a search and rescue out for uh, Daisy. Oh, in the meantime, I have to be a professional and continue with this race. Oh, my God, you guys, this is so sad. Okay, but anyway, um, the ducks, they're still uh, quacking in there, and uh, I'm just going to recap this event. Look at that. Oh, swish washing away. Um, they're still trying to hang on, but what, what are you going to do? Let's talk about uh, who's left in the sled, shall we? Um, it looks like to me, if you get a close look, it's, uh, it's a royal mess. And Tom Duck, Darla, Barney, duck a doo doo Joe MD, Miss Bun Fun, Bart, Quaker, and Co Cozy. Uh, that's who I think's in the sled coming into the finish line. Who's going to hold it? I don't know. Hey, but I'm okay. I just awkward in a little bit. I auto-rotated the ground. We didn't get the footage, but I can tell you who won. Look at that. Well, hey, Daisy, it was quack a -lack, and yeah, we had to get up at the butt quack of dawn to get these amateur finals on. Uh, that's what I don't like about amateur finals, is they run so early in the morning, you know. I get my quack sleep, but honestly, yeah, I'm just really happy um, to be up here on the podium with Gregor, Bart, uh, Miss Bunfun, and Joe MD. Man, they put on a really, really good show, and I'm just uh, really stoked to have this ginormous, ginormous trophy to put in my trophy room, because I have so many, but this will tower over them all. I'd like to thank all the posters for coming down and reading us on. Uh, um, the 2021 uh, Iron Boss Day Race was just incredible, and all the competitors were very, very generous. I will say we had a very bad wreck real, real early in that race, and uh, I just hope all the ducks are okay. But I'll take a win any way I can get it. All right, I just uh, hung on. All right, guys, have a good 2021. Cozy is out. Well, congratulations, Cozy, and Quaker Bart, Mr. Bun Fun, and Joe MD. You can let in it out. They're your top ten champions, folks. You've all been waiting for the professional sled duck championship. Look at this lineup. We have the best ducks in the whole world coming your way. We got Data Dilly Duck. We got Doopy Duck. We got Flower Power. We got Fred Flintstone. Duck Flintstone. Crack Tack. And Sherlock, we got Stitch, Tuxie, they're all in the starting game, folks. Let's go over and head to the basket. Hey, Daisy, what's up? Oh, thanks, Bummer. You betcha. We're all ready for the finals. Look at this lineup. Can you believe this? These are the best ducks in the whole world on a fresh grim trail. We got our musher doing the musher kind of warm-ups there, eh? Right? Getting all ready. Make sure the goggles ain't fogged up, no. And uh, make sure the hair looks good. Yeah, the musher is ready, I believe. We're going to get to the starting gate going. Here we go. You betcha. Look at that speed. Oh, those dogs are pulling hard, eh? Now we're uh, we're just uh, railing under the power lines and uh, getting there done. Um, There's some... Uh, oh, here we go with our first action, folks. We got a slosh, slish. Look at the air under those ducks. Oh, and none of them came out. That is what you call a professional duck. Oh, oh, looks like we lost one, folks. Who was that? I'm not 100% sure. Hello. Oh, did you see that, you guys? Let's watch that in slow motion. Can we slow it down, please, director? Slow that down. Let's watch it in replay. This separates the amateurs from the pros right here, folks. Did you see they hovered and they came right back into the sled? You cannot do that unless you are a professional duck sledder. And I'm not kidding, you guys. It might look easy. They make it look... Oh, who oh, did we lose some ducks on that one? I think so. The mustard thinks so, too. Let's watch it in slow motion.
this wood, right? It just comes right off of you on the little quackery right there. Oh, uh-oh, we lost another duck. Who was it? Who was that? Oh, two of them just went off the side of them. Oh, my goodness, that was a horrible, horrible crash. And now we continue on. I think we only have, like, six ducks left in that there basket, folks. And, uh, yeah, we're getting a little bit of air under the bag. That ought to cook off. Uh, who, the, who was that? There was a bird over our head there, I think so. Here they come, my guys. Oh, we lost a few more. Who was that? I think that was Cappy and Dad for Drake and Tate. Off the edge, you bet they were. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Now we're back to, I think, four ducks. Who are, who's left? I don't know who's left, let me look. Come on, slow it down, guys. We know that was a horrible crash. We don't need to, we're not a bunch of rubber neckers, eh? We're looking at it like 10 times. Okay, what are we doing now? Here we go, we got four ducks left. Who are these ducks? Well, it looks like our final four ducks, you guys, are Spanky Kimu, Scatchy Four solid ducks right there. I think we started with, I don't know, like 80 ducks. And now we're down to this. The top four, the final four. It's like March Madness in February. Yep, they're going to bang it up a little bit, you guys. They're hanging on. These are not amateur ducks. Look at the skill level of these ducks just hanging on. That's, oh, oh, we lost two. We lost two. Who was it? Who was it? It looks like Spanky and Kimu. Then go off to the side. That leaves Casualia and Ben. Are you two left in that? Look at that. Oh, my God. Look at all that. They were all four outside of that basket. But look at the skill level of Skatulia and Bindaroo Duckahoo. They stayed in the basket. And now, now we come down to game time, folks. This is for your 2021 Sled Duck Championship. Who will it be? Who would it be? Oh, that fight, it looks like uh, Bindaroo Duckaroo is using her little horn on her head a little bit to, to kick around Skajulia. But I'm not sure because I can I can hardly say that name, by the way. So if I'm pronouncing it wrong, please forgive me, folks. Okay, we're going back about... Oh, oh, oh no! Sakakawea, she just went off! Look at, look at Sakakawea! Oh my gosh, she's doing the huckabuck! The huckabuck and then... Watch this, folks, she just can't handle this. this is Well, Daisy, I don't know how you couldn't enjoy these races. That's one of the most spectacular wing-to-wing uh, -wing battles I've ever seen in my entire duck life. And, Daisy, I'm just glad that you're okay and we're able to give us the aerial coverage that we deserve. Let's uh, take a look at our winners, our podium today. In fifth place, we have Tate. In uh, fourth, we have Spanky. Third place, Move and Keep Move. And second place, Sakakawea. And in first place, Bindaroo. Um, my, that was a wild, wild ride. It was incredible. Um, I just want to thank everybody. Uh, I, I don't know how long we stayed in that sled. I think it was the world record. Um, and a long time. So the mushroom that was driving was incredible. Um, then uh, I think we lost a lot of ducks. Um, but uh, the four of us, the last, last four, final four, man, we hung on. We were hanging on so good, and I'm like. I was blessed by God with this horn, and this horn, man, it saved me so many times. I don't know how many times I was out of that, um, out of that, uh, sled. Uh, I was airborne most of the ride, and, uh, I gotta give it up for Sakagawea. Not only is her name hard to say, but she was always, uh, just clinging, and I didn't really know if I could beat her at one point. We were getting exhausted. Anyway, I want to thank everybody. Keep moving, thank you, first mate Tate, um, all my friends, and especially my attorney boyfriend Captain Jack. Um, everybody I just hope you uh, continue to have fun with your pups and your ducks. Okay? Signing off. This is Bindaroo Ducky Doo, your champion. Wow, Wendy Reed, you shredded this lead today. You were incredible. There's your top 10 pro finishers, folks. And you know, you can go on to the Facebook and go to the event page to get the link to see where your duck finished and how many points you got. I am Boomer Drake signing off with Jack Webb, Daisy McQuacken, and Howard Duxell. We hope you like this production and we'll see you in 2022. Stay safe, stay well, run dogs, be happy.